I am Rosario Del Nero, I am the corporate chef for Buitoni. Chefing became first a hobby, a passion, and then became a job. Maybe that's why it's so good, because it's so nice, because it is still, for me, almost like a, a, an escapade from, from, from other things. The art of cooking and the art of food is part of our patrimonio culturale. This is what we have to, to export. This is what we have to show the world. Uh, our beauties, our, our art, our music, uh, but also our food. I really like what, what, the, what the Italians are doing now, which is protecting their, their patrimonio culturale, the heritage. And how do they do that? They do that by protecting ingredients, such as olive oil, um, wines, uh, cheeses, become a certified denomination of origin. So traditional ingredients, they are now uh, protected. You know, just like you would, you know, an art uh, in, in a museum, you know, a statue or a painting. We have very simple recipes, very simple. For example, you know, pesto. Pesto is, is a masterwork, it's a masterpiece of, of Italian cuisine. And you cannot change that. If you change that, it's like, it's like uh, destroying a work of art. To me, cooking is memory too, because in a way you try to recapture all the, the lost memories. When we designed the wild mushroom agnolotti, it was very easy, for, especially for me, because being from the Alps, I, I have all these memories about, about uh, my mother going mushroom hunting. So we want to recreate that, that simple yet, yet uh, so delicious flavor of you know, roasted mushrooms, in this case, you know, porcini, cremini mushrooms that uh, we roast. And, and then we mix with a, with a duxelle that we make, and, and it's, it's so good. This is an example of how we start right from, from memories or from um, tradition. And, and we take it down to production, but without losing the, the soul, the spirit of the dish. All our fresh pasta is made in the tradition of the pasta from Emilia Romagna, from, from Bologna and Emilia Romagna, which is where the sheeted pasta was born. And by sheeted, I mean our pasta is not extruded like you would do a spaghetti or, um, or a ziti. Or the pasta is sheeted like when you do it by hand, uh, you know, with a rolling pin. Except we use, you know, several big rolling pins. But basically, it's the same principle. And we use the best ingredients, uh, you know, the semolina, which is uh, hard wheat. And then we use eggs, it's very, again, it's simple, very, very simple, but it requires a lot of um, artisan uh, approach to how, to you, how you make the pasta. Uh, it requires understanding how it's made in the, in the gold standard, which is in Emilia Romagna, by, by slowly getting it thinner and thinner with the rolling pins. And then we make the, all these cuts of pasta, uh, fresh pasta like uh, fettuccine, linguine, here we are, beautiful, eh? And of course, the same fresh pasta is used for our stuffed pasta, uh, like the tortellini or um, ravioli, agnolotti. Tortellini, they are handmade in Emilia Romagna with, with fresh pasta and a very simple fillings. Obviously, we don't handmade it, but we designed a machine that imitates the, the hands. Literally, it has two arms that they, they, they shape the tortellini. We take an ingredient, we take a recipe, and we make it. We make it just like we would make it at home. So this is what we do in these kitchens, in these culinary centers. Then these recipes become you know, our model. This is what we do. We create the recipes, keeping in mind that we're going to have to do them in a larger scale, but without, without compromising the, the ingredients nor the technique. So here we would make uh, a five gallon sauce. Then in the plant, we would make a 5,000 gallon sauce. And then we compare. We say, okay, this is the sauce made in the culinary center. This is the sauce. And until they are exactly the same, you know, we, we, don't, we don't stop. At, at all levels, 
people are realizing what's important, you know. The only way to preserve these, these memories, these, these great tastes, the simple food, is really to, to do something about it. You hungry? <laughs> Let's go and eat. At Wittoni, we are very committed to natural ingredients, simple, not because it's a, you know, it's a whim of an invention, it's because that's the way it is. That's the way tradition is. That's the way Italian cuisine was born. So we are, we are in a way going back to the roots.